get my mail real quick. What's up everybody? How you doing today? My name is David Franco and welcome to the weekend. Oh, vlog, it's vlog. Cheers to a good weekend. iPhone's vibrating. It's assuming that I'm going to Goodwill. I'm not. I'm actually going to mix up my routine today. I was going to go to Goodwill, <clears throat> but um, time just kept getting away from me because I was looking into things on eBay, more on that later. Um, and that's the thing, I don't really need to go out to Goodwill because typically Goodwill leads to a glorified lunch trip. Um, but I have lunch at home. I have a roast beef hoagie that my mom was nice enough to give me uh, yesterday since you know my mom's always getting free uh, lunch at work so that's today's lunch a free lunch for Davy boy you betcha never ever turn down a free lunch guys so today's agenda hmm, after I fix my throat of course are you crazy queen it doesn't get more copyrighted than that Except for, if you, you know, we're talking about Michael Jackson or Prince. Anyway, guys, yeah, happy Friday. Today's agenda, uh, I am going to the post office real quick. Don't you beep at me. Slow down, boy, douchebag. Dude's definitely going over 25. Definitely going, ooh. It's always a pickup truck driver, guys. Always a pickup truck driver. They just, they just think they're above the law. <clears throat> but yeah, I am skipping Goodwill. I am going to the post office to check on the potential arrival of my first ever VHS conversion job. Shout out to Steffi. Steffi is my first customer. Uh, she watches my kick streams all the time. Kick.com slash David DeFranco. It's linked right below, baby. Thank you so much for checking me out. I appreciate it, guys. We are quickly approaching, I think, 700 followers. We're getting there. It's not an insanely huge number, uh, but hey, it's better than zero, you know? Um, and obviously I'm grateful for every every bit of support I receive over there guys. So thank you so much Anyway, I believe Steffi told me on I think it was Wednesday night stream that her shipping speeds were a little behind because I think they had some kind of weather related Delay which is fine. You know, I'm in no rush. I I mean I'm getting a little impatient here You know because I just want to start working on these things. I'm just I'm just I'm just excited You know honestly though there is there's no rush because last night I was up late working on a brand new setup dedicated to VHS conversions upstairs in my gaming room. Yes, I moved my VHS conversion equipment and all that stuff up into my gaming room from the basement. I'm gonna throw up a picture right now. Check that out. Guys, it, look, it looks pretty sweet, doesn't it? And check out that ultra wide monitor. I got that monitor for $10 from Goodwill about a year ago, $10, which is an insanely good deal. That's an ultra wide gaming monitor that uh, displays up to 75 Hertz. Now the overall quality is okay. It's not like super sharp, like retina quality, like I'm used to on the MacBook Pro or whatever, but um, it's obviously good enough to get the job done. And if you look to the right of the monitor, I'm gonna throw up the picture again, check that out. That is my 2015 MacBook Pro. I was previously using the MacBook Pro, a touch bar, I had some issues that could have potentially caused a fire, not even joking. Um, and I'm gonna save those details for the next pages only of Vlogkati Vlog. Let's just say I was a little scared. I was a little nervous, burning smell and everything. And I'll talk about that next week, patrons. So stay tuned. Sorry guys, I gotta give my patrons some, some kind of special treatment besides the exclusive vlogs. Uh, but in those exclusive vlogs, I like to give them exclusive content that I don't really talk about in these vlogs. Um, but yeah, guys, Patreon is doing very well. Thank you so much. And um, yeah, going back to that MacBook Pro, it's sad how it ended, you know. I mean, the product's not dead, I'll tell you that much. It's still working. It's just not working to the point where I feel safe using it in my house. Let's just say that. So patrons, stay tuned, stay tuned. Uh, so that 2015 MacBook Pro you see was my previous MacBook Pro, guys. Uh, I, I never had any issues with it. Um, but with that said, I am in the market for a used Mac Mini. Uh, guys, I'm talking back to the years of like maybe 2014. Um, so in other words, I don't need like a super powerful computer, 
but I do want something minimal to use. And while I think using a Mac Mini <clears throat> makes more sense than using something like a MacBook Pro, because it's just more minimal, it's just, it, it, it takes up less desk, desk space, and uh, overall better thermal management. <clears throat> Sorry guys, the intro to this vlog is all over the place, because my throat is freaking out right now, and I don't want to keep clearing it on camera. That's not attractive. So yeah. Long story short, guys, I have a new setup upstairs in my gaming room, which is awesome. Mom says maybe, laughing out loud. No, Mom, we are going to Goodwill. Because if we're going to Applebee's tonight, we're going to stop at Goodwill. Um, And what else? Oh, I got paid by a web design client this week. Very nice, very nice. Still no word on my taxes, though. So that money is going to stay in my account until I find out whether I owe or not. I don't think I'm going to owe taxes, but if I do, at least I have money from that website project. Uh, but hopefully that's not the case. I'd rather put that money towards credit card debt and, and my savings. And speaking of credit card debt, I'm excited to announce this to everyone. I talked about it on the Pigeons vlog, but I want everyone to know my Apple card is officially paid off. Zero dollar balance. Um, and it's a really good feeling guys and it's it's my goal to apply that same factor to the other credit cards that I have now thankfully I don't have an insane amount of credit card debt you know mom says attachment one image but I am quickly on my way to being credit card debt free I sound congested don't I huh I wonder if I'm getting sick or if it's allergies yeah you, you can hear it like I, I can feel it too my mom's wrap Looks like a chicken salad wrap. Very nice, mom. Enjoy. And guys, there is my intro. Got a lot of things going on. And I'm really, really excited about this new setup upstairs in my gaming room. Oh, and by the way, if um, you're wondering why I'm doing the tape conversions in my gaming room and not the basement, it's basically because the basement setup was getting a little crowded and the basement setup is reserved specifically for eBay. Um, and plus, I'm not really using the butcher block for anything except for having things on display, like my old Xbox consoles and PlayStation consoles and LEDs and my fake jellyfish and all that stuff. So I figured, why not put a setup up there that I could actually use? And while I'm gaming, I could just, you know, turn around, watch the VHS tapes, make sure everything's going well, then go back to gaming, go back to bed or whatever. Get this right across from my uh, bedroom. And speaking of, Steffi just DM'd me on Discord. Hey, LOL, so the tapes haven't made it yet because I'm an idiot, LOL. At first when I called, they told me it was delayed because of weather we had in North Alabama. But when I haven't heard from you about them yet, I called again and they said the address wasn't an actual address and I wrote the zip code wrong. Oh God, Steph, that's funny. So I got the address situated and a new tracking was made. They should be there Saturday or Monday. Sorry for being a dumbass, LOL. <laughs> Steffi, you're fine. You're fine, that's funny. That's funny. I appreciate your honesty. And the irony of this is I'm at the post office right now for your tapes, but clearly, clearly they're not here. But hey, that's okay, Steph. Um, now, thankfully, I do have two other customers that are sending tapes. I haven't really heard from them, but I'm gonna go inside and see if they're there. Long intro is long. Exciting day, I know. Oh, right. Nothing in the P.O. box. So, did I drive out here for nothing? In a way, yeah, but Steph, that's okay, it's okay. I ain't the complaining type, you know? Because honestly, despite tapes being here or not, I was gonna go to Rudder's and get a coffee, then go home, have my sandwich, watch Better Call Saul, and then continue searching for a Mac Mini. Again, guys, I don't need anything fancy. Like a simple i5 Mac Mini with four gigs of RAM or eight gigs of RAM is plenty, but I do prefer one with an SSD and not a hard drive. Um, so that's what I'm after and obviously I don't want to spend a lot of money. I'm looking to spend like less than $150 Which I don't think is unrealistic because there's a lot of older Mac minis on eBay that are cheap Seriously guys, you can get a Mac mini for like 75 bucks plus plus shipping actually one I was bidding on tonight or last night As I was gonna bed I bet $60 on it I woke up today to myself losing the auction for $61 
I literally missed out on the Mac Mini by a dollar. A dollar. But that's okay. That's okay. That just gives me the option of searching even more, you know? And searching even harder for one that's potentially even better. Sorry guys, sometimes I feel like these vlog intros are too long-winded. But I have a lot to say. I'm a talker. I just love my technology and I love I love I love you guys. I love updating you on what's going on. And now I'm going into Rodders to get my coffee. So I'll see you guys at home. Mmm. Then I have to invoice. Shout out to Kristen. Not my sister, Kristen. Completely different person. You know, sometimes there are things I don't even have to say because it's pretty obvious. Like, why, why would Kristen be emailing me? Anyway, shout out to viewer Kristen. Um, she needs 11 tapes converted. So, Kristen, I'm going to go home very shortly after lunch, of course, and invoice you for your tapes. So, very cool, guys. Just looking to stay busy. So, with that said, if you guys need VHS tapes converted, let me know. That link is right below. And don't tell everyone this, but I'll give you a 10% discount. Just saying. And home I have returned to... To Reblay. One of these days, guys. One of these days, I will make the shot. It's just simple things. Speaking of, I don't know if you remember, but I used to have like a little basketball net in my old, old house in New Jersey. I'm thinking of getting one again for in here, just because like, you know, I don't know, like walk into the house, boom, take a shot, move on with my day. It's the little things that can make your day feel fresh and exciting, you know? Like coffee. Coffee is a way of life for me, guys. All right, didn't do good well, obviously I made that clear. Uh, so I'm going to have my sandwich for lunch. Guys, this place is really good. Forey's Country Store. Oh my God, the turkey is so good. I don't know if I've ever had the roast beef. And what's cool is they put everything in individual bags, meaning the onions are separated, the lettuce is separated, tomatoes separated, which means it's not gonna get soggy. And that's smart. Yeah, it's more plastic, but I do recycle, ladies. I do. Hi, little swipes. You beautiful little kitty. Is this all you guys do is sleep? I'm jealous. Not really. I'd rather work than sleep. Is that weird? And speaking of cats, there is Gizmo. Chillin'. And there's Zero. Chillin'. I love my cats. I also love my viewers. Especially those who buy from me on eBay. Shout out to Calfman. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Let me make sure. I don't I don't like getting details wrong. Calfman in Canada bought my Vanitu Transparent One speakers. I've been trying to sell these speakers for literally months. I've had people interested, but it always falls through, and sometimes I don't respond to messages. I'm not I'm not the best at responding to messages on eBay, I'll be honest. Well, because I just rely on email. My God, it looks so clean down here now that all the uh, VHS stuff is upstairs. But yeah, uh, because he lives in Canada, shipping was over $100, which is obviously a wash because I pay what he pays. But man, it, it's expensive. Um, previously, I would only ship to the US, but because he reached out to me personally, I'm like, dude, okay, not a problem. I'll update the shipping right now. And I believe, wait, I think they're right here. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna open up the box just to make sure. Because I packaged these a while ago because I knew they were gonna sell eventually. Oh my god. Yeah, this has to be the speakers. It has to be. So let's take you into the main portion of the basement. I'm pretty sure these are the speakers, but I don't want to send them something else by accident. I, I should have just labeled the box, and I know guys, this is a terrible terrible angle just trying to keep it real with you guys wow look how clean it is guys this is nice eventually these tapes are going to go away when i when i convert them all convert them all sometimes i just ramble when i talk all right tipping these up is not a problem i've got plenty of tape to go through but let's see here Damn, I did a good job taping this up. I'm impressed. <laughs> Look at that. I even patted it on the top with an Amazon mailer. Yep, there they are. Speakers are bubble wrapped. Nice tight fit around the edges. Meaning I put some wrap between there and there. There's the power cable. 
more padding over there. And here's, oh, that's right. And if there's a USB-C cable, I'm, I'm sorry, not USB-C cable. What is that, USB type B? I think that's called B. I just call it the um, printer USB cable, but I think it's USB type B. Cause it's always that type of printer cable that I can never find. Yep, USB type B. Yeah, it's a, it's a thick kind. So cool, there you go. Very, very nice. As you can see, it's nicely packaged. A little bit of padding on top. I'm gonna tape this back up and prepare it for shipping. I am shipping it via UPS. I don't mind paying a pickup fee. It's like $15. It's a write-off. And by that, I mean, if they can come by tomorrow to pick it up while I'm sleeping, because let's be honest, I'm gonna be up late tonight streaming on kick. Link right below, baby, don't forget. Um, then why not do that? All right. Ignore everything I just said. Actually, I'm probably gonna end up cutting myself off in the in the vlog when I edit this because change of plans. I'm shipping it right now. So dude, enjoy. Uh, because it ended up only giving me options for USPS for some reason and not UPS. Shipping for the buyer was $109. That's crazy. That's insane. But hey, he didn't mind paying it. And shipping for me was $118. So I lost what, like $9 on shipping? No, not, not a huge deal. Uh, but I'm just so glad I can drop it off at the post office real quick. And they're closing in either eight minutes or a half hour, I'm not sure. But uh, shipping international is something I don't usually do. So yeah, I mean, it's a little more complicated. I had to print this big old piece of paper, um, you know, with its value, declaring what it is, all that stuff. Uh, but this is good, this is good. I think I need to ship to Canada more often. I mean, I'm opening up an, an entire country of sales, you know? Yeah, it's a little more expensive, but like I said, the buyer pays the shipping, I pay the shipping, so it's usually a wash. This dude is just hanging out in the street with his van. So yeah, I'm gonna drop this off real quick. Dude, enjoy, enjoy shipping it via USPS, and I don't know what USPS hands it off to. I don't know what your postal service is called over there in Canada, but yeah, let me know. Yeah, I could Google it, but yeah, I like to get you guys involved in the comment section. And uh, besides that, I don't have anything else to say. Guys, th that was a good sale. That was a really good sale. I sold the speakers for $350, um, plus shipping, of course. So, very cool. Thank you so much for your business, I appreciate it. 25 pounds of awesomeness, dude. You are going to love these speakers. They sound absolutely phenomenal. I just don't use them anymore. Um, so, enjoy. Today's a good Friday. Can't complain. Well, that was easy. Enjoy your speakers. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Now I'm going to invoice. That's gonna fall. Never mind. I'm gonna invoice a uh, VHS conversion client slash customer. Oh, but first, <laughs> I almost died. Before that, guys, let's go into my gaming room. It's a little dark in here right now, so I'll do this. Here it is. Let's wake that up. The 2015. MacBook Pro is back, guys. Isn't that crazy? It's a little dirty. I got I got to clean it. But again, this this is this is temporary. Nice ultra wide monitor. Got the camcorder over here. Hold on, let me. Yeah, that's a little better. Uh, anyway, I got my original camcorder over here for mini DV tapes, and VCR over here for regular tapes. Got my VHSC VHSC adapter. David, speak like a human being. Anyway, there it is. Got my trackpad charging, keyboard, and this on-air sign. No, I'm not streaming. Just a clever way of blocking all those cables because the um, video adapters I use take up a lot of space with cables. And there you go. Not bad, right guys? So I've got my gaming setup over here and a little VHS conversion service. And here is that shoe rack I bought last week at Goodwill, which obviously I'm gonna be using for VHSs. So this is a good setup, guys. Everything is gonna be so neat 
and organized and well, I'm excited. Reminder, your tapes will degrade over time. That's not an opinion. Unfortunately, it's a fact. Uh, so if you have memories that you wanna convert, reach out to me. All right, change of plans. I had no idea, but Kristen and Charlotte are over for a few hours for, for dinner. Mom and uh, Kristen are in the beer mart. It's literally called beer mart. Uh, getting our neighbor Bob some beer. I think as a token of thanks, token of gratitude for watching the cats. Charlotte, say hi. Hi. What are you doing? Play. Playing with what? My iPad. iPad? Why are you so quiet? She's focused. What is that? What is that, Charlotte? What animal is that? Why do you always get quiet on camera, but off camera you're just screaming and everything? What are your hopes and dreams in life, Charlotte? What do you want to be when you grow up? What are your thoughts on, th thoughts on the current stock market? Pick. I swear, guys. Off, off camera, we were playing hide and seek. And for some reason, she just stood in a corner, literally facing the cabinets and started screaming. Like the ending <laughs> to the first Blair Witch Project. Charlotte, have you seen the Blair Witch Project? Okay, bye, Charlotte. I'm leaving you, okay? <laughs> she, she literally doesn't care. She's in her own world. <laughs> Hopefully I'll get something on camera. Um, it's not really my goal to get too much of her tonight. Um, because next week's Easter, right? Is Easter next week? Charlotte, is the Easter bunny coming next week? She is so focused. Charlotte, good job. You're so smart. Say I know. Small hat on the big monkey. There you go. Good job. Now big hat on the small monkey. <laughs> That's silly, isn't it? Yes. The monkey can't see. Put the big tie on the big monkey. Put the small tie on the small monkey. Good job. Awesome. Good job, Charlotte. High five. Yes. And there you go. I'm just gonna let her focus. It, it's it's small skills like this that add up to bigger skills, bigger thinking. Look at her go. Hi, Debbie. Hi. I don't think I've vlogged you before. Ever? No, nah, just today. Say hi, is your, is your iPhone nice? Hi. Oh my God! I'm not she even gonna say friends. what passcode you just put in. What's the point? Did she? I have to do a passcode for it to get my work stuff on here. It's <laughs> oh so hot, honey. Can you blow? Little bites. It's really hot. Thank you, Mom. Can I test it? Guys, I got a cheeseburger, bacon cheeseburger, pink, and a side of coleslaw. It was either this or french fries, and look how much coleslaw they give you. I feel like they should give you more coleslaw. Yeah, especially if you don't get fries. If you don't get fries, yeah. <laughs> look at yeah. it. What the heck? Cheers. Is it hot? Um, hold on. Mm. Just wait. Mm. 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 Charlie, you need to be nice to mommy. So good. You. Oh yeah. Charlotte, you want to try it? No? And I'm home. No, I didn't drive in my socks. I just forgot my camera, so I had to go back out and get it. Hi, keys. Oh, my keys. I love you guys. Guys, it's already past 9.30. I am going live on kick. Oh, wow, it's almost 10 o'clock. Damn it. Yes, it's pretty obvious. I did not vlog a lot of Charlotte. But honestly, it wasn't that kind of night. I was just bonding with her, just playing. Um, but next weekend is a Charlotte Focus weekend because next weekend is Easter, I promise. This is just a preview of a big old Charlotte weekend next weekend. So 
In other words, I'm excited for that because she's so much fun to play with. Uh, she's so sweet and she's really, what's the word? Hey, guys, chill. Chill. Zero is doing nothing to you, Gizmo. Snarky. That's a word. Snarky. Um, basically, Charlotte was moody in the car, right? And mom, Gigi, was trying to talk to Charlotte. And Charlotte was like, don't talk to me. <laughs> she was just moody. And then Gigi was standing in the way of the TV. And Charlotte's like, Gigi, move. And she, she just goes through her moody stages. Uh, but generally speaking, she was in a good mood for the uh, most part, right? Okay, a little stripes, you go over there. But yeah, she, she's so much fun, I love her. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. Mom even sent me home with some Fruit Loops because <laughs> I told her I was buying milk. And uh, tonight was definitely a Fruit Loops focused night. Charlotte's obsessed with these. I haven't, I haven't had Fruit Loops in the longest time, so I'm excited to have these after my stream. Uh, but either way, I'm gonna be buying a box tomorrow at Target. I love cereal, guys, I eat a lot of cereal. All right, that's it, guys. I'm tired. I am so tired. I'm going to get a shower. Hopefully, that'll wake me up a little bit. Uh, but regardless, I'm excited to stream. Thanks so much for watching day one of the weekend of Vlog. Vlog. I'm sorry I didn't go thrifting. I thought we were going to go thrifting tonight, but the whole Charlotte thing ended up being a surprise. I wish you would have told me, Mom, but that's okay. It's not a big deal. I'll see you guys tomorrow for day two. Well, I think it is fair. I want you upstairs. But. No, no, no buts. I want you upstairs pronto. <laughs> I love me some Full House. I've been watching it like every night lately while I'm going to bed. Hi, Giz. You going to be nice? I say that because he just started trying to smack Zero for no reason. Right, Zero? You did nothing wrong. Hi, Giz. A little stwipes. Zero. Oh, I love my keys. Giz, I mean, if, if you want to go out, you can go out. Go ahead. Yeah, Giz. No? That's what I thought. It's all wet and gloomy out there. Guys, it is already 5.13. I was up earlier to do laundry and all that stuff, but then I went back to sleep, and when I say go back to sleep, I mean go back to sleep. I fell asleep for like a few more hours. Yeah, I checked my clock on my iPad, and I just sprung out of bed. I'm like, what? It's that late? But it's okay, guys. It's the weekend, baby. It's the weekend. I really do think I work hard during the week, so I try to have chill weekends. But hey guys, this is probably going to be a short weekend vlog. Uh, so stay tuned for a good weekend vlog next weekend. Easter, baby. And also, patrons, don't worry. You guys will get a nice, long patrons-only vlog this week. I think the newest one was, what, just under 1 hour and 40 minutes long? Can't say it enough, my weekends are kind of boring. They're not that exciting. Um, yeah, I could go out and do things, but I choose not to. I'm a homebody. I like I like being home, you know, that's just who I am. But during the week, I go out a lot. I show you guys my um, process of thrifting and all that stuff. And of course, I hang out with the parentals for dinner. Uh, we are going to start taking walks soon since the weather is getting nice, even though it's not really so nice today. But that's Pennsylvania for you. Anyway, I'm babbling. Uh, I am going to do a quick unboxing of an Amazon package that just showed up today. And I just ordered this last night. Amazon, you're the best. What do you guys think it is? I can promise you this, it's not very exciting to you, but to me it's pretty exciting because I am going to have a dedicated hard drive for my VHS conversions for upstairs on my MacBook Pro setup, which will hopefully soon be a Mac mini setup. I'm currently sending offers and bidding on whatever, you know, like random Mac minis that I find on eBay. Um, and I'm hoping to get one for cheap. Again, I don't want to spend too much money. Uh, this is the two terabyte Seagate portable drive. I have, I think like three or four of these already and they have yet to fail me. So I just keep buying them and buying them. But this one is going to be used specifically for your VHS conversions. So in other words, your data is safe. Also, I'm going to be saving your data on my Google Drive as well. So if you guys, for whatever reason, come back to me three months later and say, David, I lost the files. What do I do? You simply ask me and I'll get those files back for you because they'll either be in the cloud or saved on this hard drive. Organization is everything, guys. I'm a big, big fan of organization. Uh, so I will get this set up probably later today or realistically 
just tomorrow. And by setup, I mean, just plug it in, format it, and you're good to go. All right, I'm going to my coffee, watch Better Call Saul. Again, today is a lazy day. I'm not hiding anything about it. I'm not hardworking today. I'm not going to be productive today. I'm just going to be a lazy person who enjoys Better Call Saul. Some sheets, because I've not had, guys, I've not had anything to eat, and it's almost 5.30. So I'm only going to have one meal today, which I'm okay with. I'm kind of doing intermittent fasting, my own version of it anyway. See ya. You gotta love physics. All right. Got a full battery. Where do you guys wanna go? Goodwill, really? Of all places? Guys, I agree. I did not get a chance to vlog it yesterday because of Shar Shar. Come on, Shar Shar. You're messing up my routine. That's gonna end love you. Guys, I, I really hope Charlotte looks back on these vlogs someday. Uh, because think about it, th these vlogs have an infinite lifespan. Long, long after I'm dead, which could be, I don't know when that's gonna be. In theory, these vlogs will never ever die themselves. <laughs> And I think that's cool. Start making memories now. Anyway, it's 6.45, guys. Leave my hat off. It's hitting my coat. I am indeed going to um, Goodwill. Goodwill closes at 8. And I'm going to Sheets anyway for dinner. Uh, I don't really have anything going on this weekend. But I'm glad I got to see the fam yesterday. That was fun. Then uh, next week, it's Easter. I know I keep saying that, but I'm legitimately excited for, for Easter, guys. Mainly because of Charlotte. With our, with our Easter egg con, the Easter egg baskets. Uh, it's just, just gonna be a good, overall good vibes kind of day. And I'm excited to vlog it for you. Cause I feel like there's not really much going on right now in my uh, weekend life, you know? I just don't really do anything on the weekends, lately anyway. Obviously that'll start to pick up as we inch closer to the nicer weather. For example, it's currently 40 degrees out and I just asked my Nest Hub she said it actually feels like 30 because of the wind chill. So in other words, you just can't go outside. There's really nothing to do outside. But as it gets nicer, I'll be outside more often, take more, more, more walks, all that stuff. I know, I'm talking like I have to, to prove something. But hey, you know what? At least I keep it real. There are so many people out there like myself doing the same exact thing today. Staying indoors, watching TV, and just chilling. Guys, Better Call Saul is incredible. I don't know if you're into cinema and Hollywood and all that stuff as much as I am, but if you pay attention to details and the way they set up shots and audio and all that stuff in Better Call Saul, it really is a masterpiece in my eyes. Like it, It's so damn good. It's so good, as is Breaking Bad, of course. But I will say this. While Breaking Bad's story is typically more interesting, because that's what, you know, sets the foundation for all the characters, I think Better Call Saul is better shot um, in terms of cinematography. Shout out to Alex Smith. Um, I will read that when I can do so safely. Patron just uh, commented. Thank you, Alec, for your support. I appreciate you, dude. But yeah, um, we're going to go to Goodwill Guys for a little bit. Probably going to be in and out in like 5 or 10 minutes because on Saturdays, it's pretty tough. It's pretty tough, especially on days like today where it's cold. People just want to be inside. Then we're going to hit up Sheets. Guys, I have not treated myself to a good Sheets meal in quite a while. Because you know me, I've been trying to cut back and save money and just buy cheaper meals. But tonight, tonight I'm getting my usual spicy chicken sandwich with a good appetizer. Uh a coffee whatever you know I'm excited and don't diss my sheets the really people like damn it it's a gas station no if you've never had sheets then I I just can't expect you to understand why it's so good like it really is good food it's not five star restaurant good food but it's pretty good food guys I mean it really is all right I'll see you good well I'm gonna listen to my podcast I'll see you when I see you. Oh, wait, hold on. We're hitting a red light. So I might have a chance to read your comment, Alec. Yeah, we're good. Alex Smith says, we just got hammered with 18 inches of snow. And the kicker is after Monday, it will be in the 50s. And Tuesday, it's set to pour. 
should make the roads interesting. 18 inches of snow this late? Actually, this, this early in the spring? Dude, sorry to hear that. I, I, I mean, I get stressed with like three or four inches of snow. But 18 inches of snow in late March? That's insane. Yeah, dude, stay safe, stay safe. For real, can I go? I'll see you guys at Goodwill, all right? Get out of here. On your last device. All right, all right, all right. It's seven o'clock and still pretty light out. Definitely a good thing. And look, I parked pretty close. Oh, that bird poop is still there. Normally in the Pigeons vlog, I park way down there. All right, guys, let's go. I did not bring my chest lanyard, uh, so I'm just gonna handhold everything today. But even with that said, don't have high expectations. But then again, you never know. Maybe I'll find something good. Let's go. It feels weird not being here yesterday. So I just feel like I missed out on some stuff. But upon first glance, I'm not really seeing any video games. Hmm. I'm telling you, this might be a very quick visit. And I might hit up Target real quick just to get some cereal and whatever. Yeah, a few random things for the house. Right, let's go check out the carts. Here's some more media. But of course, no games. These are flipped, come on, come on. Nope. Just last night we were talking to Kristen about A Dog's Purpose, the movie. A Dog's Way Home. Is this the third one? I don't know if a third movie is confirmed yet, but I know all the movies are based on a book. Hmm. Very sad movies, but like a good sad. I mean, especially if you're an animal lover like myself. Oh wow, look at all the notebooks. You should absolutely be a dollar though. I don't know why they're charging two dollars, but wow, that's actually kind of beautiful. Look at that. Ooh, baby, that is mesmerizing. A lot of notebooks though, wow. That's, that's pretty cool for a student or anyone who needs notes. But in terms of stuff I want or need, I'm not really seeing much. Would you look at that? Two VHSC tapes. Very cool. I'm showing this for a reason because just last week I got an adapter in from Amazon that can read these tapes. So in other words, if you have any home, home videos, home movies, or whatever, on tapes like those, hit me up and I'll convert them for you. Coming out? You're welcome. Good problem. Take care. All right. Didn't get anything. I didn't expect to get anything. And now we got a target to get cereal. Shout out to Charlotte for getting me back into Fruit Loops. I'm just I just been in the mood for Fruit Loops lately. And I'm home. Hey, little stripes. Hi. Gizzy Wiz. I don't know why you still want to go outside. It's cold and windy. Zero's chilling on the couch. Oh, so close. Yeah, if you guys saw what I saw at Target today, and then the aftermath at Sheets, oh my God. Let's just say sweet, sweet justice for some like, very obnoxious pickup truck drivers. And I realize not everyone who drives a pickup truck is a douchebag, but oftentimes on the road, you know, when I see stupidity, that's typically what they're driving. And let's just say like a clan of them were just huddled together at Target and the cops showed up and Sweet, sweet justice was served. Yeah, it was pretty cool. It made me happy. All right. Tonight's stream snack. I'll try not to eat all of this. I'll try to be smart about it. White cheddar popcorn. Arguably their best flavor. Am I right or am I right? Let me know in the comment section. And shout out to Sharshar. Got me some Fruit Loops. And tonight's dinner. Ooh, I am hyped for this, guys. This is a treat. I got a cup of fries, if I can get them out. Cup of fries. The fries are always good at Sheets. Ooh, got some loose ones in there. Size of cheddar cheese. Actually, it's nacho cheese. It's got a little bit of a kick to it. And spicy chicken sandwich with heavy mayonnaise, uh, honey mustard, lettuce, tomato, cheddar cheese, and diced onion. Let's eat. Perfect. Hey, Gizmo, he's not doing anything to you. 
I gotta keep my kids under control. Look who's coming in. Yes, Gizmo did eventually go out. Excuse me, Giz. Watch your tail. Good boy. And now Zero went outside, but he'll be back in later. He always goes out in the morning. Yes, it is the morning. 5.15 in the morning at that. Guys, thank you so much for another great stream. A little bit of weird vibes at first, but everything worked out because I love you guys. I love you. Um, really, really good times. We got three wins in Warzone. Um, and I'm almost plat one in Halo Infinite. I can't complain. I love my live stream viewers. It's right below, guys. Please check me out. I appreciate it. Oh, and shout out to Kick. I'm pretty sure Kick featured me on their homepage again because I had like 70 something people watching me at some point. Typically, my good average is like 30 to 40, but to have over 70 people watching Halo Infinite, that's, that's pretty sweet. So, Kick, thank you so much. Love you guys. All right. I need sleep. Yes, my nose is still itchy. I don't know if it's allergies or what, but it's annoying, you know? I don't know what's going on my nose. I'll see you tomorrow for day three. Oh, and shout out to Steph if you're watching. Thank you so much for all the gifted subs tonight. I really appreciate that. It means a lot. All right, I'll see you guys later. Happy Sunday, everybody. How are you doing today? Fried chicken, Watt Ross. Cranberry. I almost had cantaloupe. Mmm. Mmm. Dude. Mom makes awesome fried chicken, guys. Cheers. Oh, yeah. Thank right, you, Mom. What? You're so excited. No, seriously. This, this is my first and only meal today. Why? You didn't eat it all? Nope. Save it. Take another chicken in. That's, that's, that's how I handle my intermittent fasting. I always court it. You need to have um, more chicken then. See, I don't eat as bad as people think I do. You need to have more chicken then. On the last night, I will say I was stuffing my face with smart food, white cheddar popcorn. Mm -hmm. Isn't that stuff good? Yeah, that is good. Mm. Polynesian from Chick-fil-A. Mm. And zesty buffalo from Chick-fil-A. Oh, yeah. Hey, right, Mom, come here. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Runners on me. Okay. Oh, yeah. Because I gave you chicken. Mm-hmm. Thank you very much. You're welcome, baby. Can I get the water? Yes. Yes. I know, I need to get water. Sorry. One week from today, Easter Bunny's coming. Mm -hmm. This year I'm gonna shoot him. And I am home. This is where we must say goodbye. Kind of a short vlog this week, end, but not really, because I was editing, I'm like, oh wow. I recorded more than I thought I did, because I just love to yap. I just enjoy running my mouth. That's a, that's a good way of describing my uh, personality. I'm a talker, guys. I always I always have a lot to talk about. Anyway, yeah, I am done. I'm gonna watch some Better Call Saul, enjoy my coffee that I just bought. Shout out to mom and dad for having me over for dinner. I always appreciate it. And uh, I'll be over there again tomorrow. NZ Pages only, a vlogity vlog. I think we're having chicken salad tomorrow. I'm a big, big chicken salad guy. Uh, so I am excited. But for now, guys, I must go. I have to finish editing this vlog. Um, I think I found a Mac Mini I'm gonna buy on eBay tonight, so that's cool. Then I gotta preview the vlog while doing the dishes, cleaning up around the house, all that stuff. So my night is just beginning. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. I appreciate you. Have a great week ahead, or a great weekend ahead. I sound angry, I'm not. I'm just being enthusiastic. Thank you guys so much for being you, and I'll talk to you later. Peace.